for the majority of this video, I'm going to be looking down because I have a script that I'm reading. So don't feel offended if I don't look at you. The problem with Smash fan polls. Most people here like speculating about the next character and the new DLC. And they make fan polls to try and decide who the fan base really wants the most. But here's the most wanted character. No one. TLDR, there's never been a poll, nor is there one now or ever, that'll tell you the absolute number one most popular character. And it doesn't matter since that's not what Sakurai goes off of anyway. Obvious, I know, but keep watching. Sabi, Papa Gino's, and Scott the Waz, I'll be referring to them as SPS, took a poll of the most wanted characters for DLC, where people were to write in only one of their most wanted and only one of their most hated. The problem with that is, people have more than one most wanted. Even then, you can casually want someone without them being your most wanted, especially if your most wanted's already in the game. Most polls fail to make a questionnaire that satisfies the need of this question. Who should be in Smash? It should be taken into account who the fanbase wants and who the fanbase doesn't want. But it should also be taken into account the degree for how much for both sides. For instance, once again, single choice polls like the SPS and GameFAQs polls that you see on GameFAQs only allow you to write in one character, which will force you to alienate your most wanted. But then also, a multiple choice poll only takes into account what characters people are okay with, disregarding the ones that people don't want and the degree to which people want a character. I recently did a poll asking people to rank a list of 20 highly nominated characters from the SPS poll from one to five stars, basically. Keep in mind, these are not the official top 20. The poll I took is from a pool of 107 voters. Here are the rankings of the characters I made a poll around in the rankings from the unofficial results from the SPS poll. We will call this Poll A. 20, Tracer. 19, Byleth. 18, Leon Kennedy. 17, Monster Hunter. 16, Ryu Hayabusa. 15, Lloyd Irving. 14, Dante. 13, Rex. 12, Waluigi. 11, Bandana D. 10, Phoenix Wright. 9, Crash Bandicoot. 8, Rayman. 7, Doom Guy. 6, Reimu Hakure. 5, Shantae. 4, Isaac. 3, Sora. 2, Steve. 1, Gino. Pretty convenient for you, Papa Genos. Out of a desire for transparency, I will tell you my opinion of this poll. I unpacked frustrating first. Reached in and found the word worst. Here are the results of my poll from a pool of 107 votes, only tallying the five star votes casted. This will be known as poll B. Number 20, Tracer with two votes. Number 19, Violet, six votes. 18, Lloyd, Irving, 10 votes. 17, Shantae, 12 votes. 16, Monster Hunter, 12 votes. Number 15, Reimu Hakure, 13 votes. Number 14, Rayman, 13 votes. Number 13, Dante, 13 votes. Number 12, Waluigi, 14 votes. Number 11, Ryu Hayabusa, 14 votes. Number 10, Doom Slayer, 14 votes. Number 9, Steve, 16 votes. Number 8, Isaac, 16 votes. Number 7, Sora, 17 votes. Number 6, Leon Kennedy, 17 votes. Number 5, Rex, 18 votes. Number 4, Phoenix Wright, 18 votes. Number three, Gino, 18 votes. Number two, Crash Bandicoot, 21 votes. Number one, Bandana D, 21 votes. So from that, you can obviously see there is some drastic change. Granted, these are the uh, unofficial results. For comparison reasons, here are the results of these same characters, but from another unofficial Smash Facts poll I ran not too long ago with 274 votes. We will know that as poll C. Tracer got zero votes. Reimu Hakari, 32 votes. Steve, 38 votes. Violet, 40 votes. Lloyd Irving, 46 votes. Leon Kennedy, 49 votes. Rex, 54 votes. Monster Hunter, 55 votes. Ryu Hayabusa, 55 votes. Bandana D, 58 votes. Shantae, 61 votes. Dante, 62 votes. Isaac, 63 votes. Rayman, 63 votes. Waluigi, 64 votes. Sora, 66 votes. Gino, 68 votes. Doom Guy, 70 votes. Phoenix Wright, 71 votes. And Crash Bandicoot, 84 votes. Now here's my 107 poll with only the votes in favor of each respective character accounted for. We will know that as poll D. Tracer, 17 votes. Byleth, 24 votes. Reimu Hakari, 
33 votes. Shantae, 35 votes. Steve, 36 votes. Sora, 37 votes. Rex, 38 votes. Monster Hunter, 39 votes. Gino, 40 votes. Waluigi, 41 votes. Lloyd Irving, 41 votes. Ryu Hayabusa, 47 votes. Phoenix Wright, 47 votes. Isaac, 47 votes. Bandana D, 47 votes. Leon Kennedy, 48 votes. Rayman, 51 votes. Dante, 53 votes. Crash Bandicoot, 56 votes. Doom Guy, 62 votes. As you can see, there was drastic change from poll B to poll D. Granted that there was some that didn't vote five stars on any of the 20 listed above because the most wanted wasn't there. But here's the 107 poll when each character is aggregated on a scale of one to five. We will know this as poll E. Tracer, 2.49 out of five. Reimu Hakuri, 2.74 out of five. Byleth, 2.78 out of five. Gino, 2.82 out of five. Steve, 2.86 out of 5. Shantae, 2.88 out of 5. Waluigi, 2.95 out of 5. Sora, 3.01 out of 5. Rex, 3.03 out of 5. Bandana D, 3.15 out of 5. Monster Hunter, 3.21 out of 5. Lloyd Irving, 3.26 out of 5. Phoenix Wright, 3.3 out of 5. Isaac, 3.33 out of 5. Rayman, 3.35 out of 5. Dante, 3.37 out of 5. Ryu Hayabusa, 3.37 out of 5. Leon Kennedy, 3.41 out of 5. Doom Guy, 3.49 out of 5. And Crash Bandicoot, 3.54 out of 5. While the only stark change for a singular character between Pole E and Pole D is Ryo Hayabusa's ranking, most of the characters here hovered near the rankings they had in Pole D, while most of the rankings changed drastically from Pole B, with the exception of Isaac Byleth and Tracer. Here's the problem with polls. None of them work. If you only wrote in one character, you'd have to alienate one of your most wanteds. If you wrote in as many characters as you'd want, you'd forget a few, and you wouldn't account for the ones you didn't know you wanted. If it were multiple choice, we'd only take into account what people want and not what people don't want. On the flip side, even though rating characters from 1 to 5 stars is the method that best answers the question who should be in Smash, not many people are going to sit down and rate 200 characters in a row and then you wouldn't have accurate results. The results of my 107 poll can't even be taken seriously because it fails to recognize popular characters such as Dixie Kong, Skull Kid, Paper Mario, Shadow the Hedgehog, Master Chief, and so on. Furthermore, after characters get confirmed for Smash, other characters' popularity shoot up if the former and latter characters seem to negate each other in popularity. Banjo is a good exception of this. When he got confirmed, Crash's popularity shot up and describe him with adjectives. Whoa! Boy, that was one big ugly bear. Of course it goes without saying that most people, when they make polls, don't consider Goku, Mickey Mouse, Spongebob, or Iron Man as possible characters because that's dumb. But those characters do have a following in the Smash community regardless. And any poll that doesn't have them doesn't represent the Smash community as a whole. Who's the most popular character? Pajama Sam. The only character worth putting in Smash. <laughs> For example, this boy can grow up to be a huge man, but still have a boyish face. Boy is a noun, but the ending ish makes it an adjective. Boyish. That describes the huge man's face. Get it? <laughs>